Quarterback Jim Kelly spots wide receiver. When I first went to University of Miami, they were just building the program back up. It wasn't doing well, and I think that the coaching staff knew we had players, but it was a matter of convincing everybody and getting that, that will to win back there. My most memorable moment was the first day that I walked out of that tunnel at Rich Stadium, which is where the Buffalo Bills played against the New York Jets in 1986. And I looked up in the stands and there was my mother, my father, and my five brothers that all helped me achieve that ultimate goal and I was playing the NFL. There's so many amazing things about going to the Super Bowl four years in a row. And I think more than anything, if you hear anybody talk about the Buffalo Bills, the first word that'll come to their minds is resiliency. Yeah, we wanted to win, but we never gave up. And I think people now that look back on it, and they've said to me, I'm amazed how you guys did it. There's teams that can't even get back twice. And now for us to do it four years in a row, that's unbelievable. And yeah, of course I wanted to win, but you know, just wasn't meant to be. For me, being inducted on the first ballot of the Pro Football Hall of Fame was, to be honest with you, it's almost, it's, I almost still pinch myself. But probably the best part of it all is when I was giving my speech, I looked to my right and there was my wife, my two daughters. And for me that day, my son, Hunter, was there that day. And I remember when I was picked, I prayed every night, every night that if it was God's will, that my son would be there that day that I gave my speech, and he was. Well, of course, uh, our foundation exists because my son, who was born on my birthday, Valentine's Day, um, was diagnosed at four months of age with a fatal genetic disease called Crabbe leukodystrophy, and he did not have any motor skills, but um, we started the foundation, and when we started, we knew that it wasn't gonna help our son. We knew that it was gonna help other kids. But that was our goal, that was our dream, that was our mission, because we saw what our son went through every day of his life, and it was not good. And now, as of today, we are making progress. When you have families walking up to you, holding babies in their arm and they're thanking you, you understand why? I was a chosen father with a little boy named Hunter, that we could make a difference. Of course, back then, I didn't want that. I wanted a healthy son, like everybody, especially born on my birthday. I mean, the game plan was done. The script was written. I knew what he was gonna do. I knew what I was gonna do with him. But good Lord had different plans for me. And I look back on it, I get it now. Yeah, back then I wasn't, I, I didn't get it. I was mad at every single person that told me that, my, that I was a chosen father. I don't wanna hear that, I want a healthy son. But I get it now. I see the families that come in with their children, see kids that had the exact same disease as my son, that are walking, talking, and smiling now. But we're still a long ways away. So um, I just pray to God that um, they finally get it. I, you know, I look back at all the things I've been through in my life. They prepare me for what I'm going through now with the cancer. Diagnosed not just once, but twice with cancer. Yeah, you have your doubts, but I don't anymore. If my son could go through what he went through, mine should be a cakewalk because I saw what he did. I saw how he fought every day of his life. I look back on it and I'm like, man, I don't have it that bad. And if he can do it and beat it the way he did, this should be easy for me. Here I am today. You know what? We all go through tough times. It's your attitude you have. My attitude right now is to be able to make a difference for others because my son, still to this day, even though he's in heaven, is making a difference for others. So I've been blessed to be, have a great leader in our family, and his name is Hunter James Kelly. No doubt about it.